Okay, you right. Welcome back to school. Hope you all had a wonderful holiday and congratulations on completing your first year of high school. Now that you're not in year seven, uh, you probably will get bullied, but not as much, so uh, enjoy that. Anyway, my name is Mr. Roberts and I'll be your PE teacher for this semester, all right? So if we can all just, uh, excuse me, mate, you over there. Me? No, the picture behind you. Yeah, you. What's your name? Oh, um, my name's Yusuf. Yusuf. Right. Well, um, you fooled no one, right? Great joke, but if you could just get to your own class, all right? Year 12, I think, is in block K, so um, just pick up your stuff and move over there, all right? Oh, bro. Anyway. This is my class. Listen, mate, joke's over, all right? I'm trying to start a lesson here, and you're distracting the whole class, all right? I'm going to tell your year master about it, Yusuf. All right, so I'm not going to ask you again. Pick up your stuff and go. Oh, but I'm not, uh, I'm not joking, sir. I'm meant to be here. It's what my timetable says. I've got my timetable here. Somewhere. Yeah, here. It says, uh, Mr. Roberts, C12, PE, 9am. Timetable, yeah, I'll have a look at this, mate. Yeah, have a look. Okay, right. Well, anyone can make this up, mate. Give me your ID card, mate. Give me your ID card. You got a school card? School, school ID, yeah, I've got it somewhere. I've got it somewhere here, sir. Hurry up, mate. Give me a second. Just give me a second, sir. Come on, mate. Oh, Found it, Brady. Hey. So you're telling me that you, Yusuf Khalil, are in year eight, age 13. Yeah. You dead set look like you're in year 12, mate. Actually, no. You look like you're old enough to go pour yourself a schooner. What's a schooner? What's a schooner? It, mate, it's only the greatest gift in the world. Holy shit. Oh, so you swore. Shut up, mate. I'm in disbelief so I can swear, all right? Anyway, Yusuf, you've convinced me, so, uh, yeah, you can stay, I guess. I'll keep this just for further investigation, all right? So leave this with me. All right, anyway, back to the lesson. Physical education, PE. Look, guys, it's gonna be a long semester, all right? So I expect everyone to work hard in all areas of study. Just just back to you, mate. Um, what do they feed you at home? Like, uh, a whole cow or something? Like, what do you, what do you eat? Oh, I just, um, I eat uh, Cocoa Pops. Cocoa Pops. Yeah, right, Cocoa Pops. All right, fuck me. Um, okay, anyway, if we can all just, um, open up our textbook that we all should have bought uh, from the bookstore. If you haven't, you failed already, all right? So chapter one, we'll start from there. And just back to you, mate, the um, the beard, the beard, like what's up with that? Like I can't even grow chest hair and I'm 43 years old. So like, what, what, what's up with that? Oh yeah, I forgot to shave this morning, sir. I'm, I'm sorry, I'll, I'll go shave at recess. I was just in a bit of a rush this morning, so. Shave. So a 13 year old boy knows how to put a blade to his face. That's amazing. I didn't know how to shave until I was 23 years old, mate. What's, what's your background, mate? What's your ethnicity? Oh, um, Australian. Don't lie to me, mate. I was born here soon, um... Yeah, okay, you may be born here, but, like, Yusuf is not an Australian name, right? So, like, what, what's your parents' background? Where are they from? Oh, um, Lebanon. Right, so you're Lebanese. Yeah, that explains it. You Lebanese people are built different, right? If I was, if I was looking like that when I was 13, 14 years old, I'd be getting into the pub, mate. I'll be getting on the piss with me old man at the age of 14. I don't know what that means. Oh, don't worry, mate. You'll understand soon the true power you hold, mate. You'll understand, mate. Anyway, uh, back to what we were doing, uh, this textbook here. So if we can all just open up. Uh, just back to you, mate. Uh, do you play any sports? Oh, no. Nah, I just, um, I ride my bike sometimes to 7-Eleven to get a Slurpee. It's my exercise. Right, well that's not really a sport. So uh, anyway, I coach year eight and year nine footy and I was thinking maybe you come down to training uh, tomorrow morning because we need big boys like you if we're gonna compete with the other schools. Because right now, our team is just a bunch of toothpicks. I don't know how to play, sir. Mate, that doesn't matter, all right? There's only two things that you gotta do. Number one is to tackle and tackle hard. And number two, is when you get the ball, you gotta bulldoze yourself over the opposition, all right? You gotta come from the back fence and run it straight. Does it hurt? Does what hurt? Playing footy. No, it doesn't hurt, and besides, who's gonna hurt you? Look at you. If I was 13 years old and I saw a bloke who's the same age as me, built like you, running towards me, you think I'm gonna stop him? No. 
And another thing, forgot to mention this one, is that you've got to be angry on game days, all right? It's all in the attitude. So do you get angry? Yeah, sometimes. All right, so what makes you angry? So are you going to teach us PE or are we just going to... Oi, you want to fail PE? Um, uh, no. Then shut up, I'm trying to recruit someone here. Anyway, what makes you angry? Oh, um, when I play FIFA and I lose, and then the opponent just doesn't shut up. He calls me this, he calls me that. So he just kind of roasts me, you know? Beautiful. I want that sort of energy onto the field. Just imagine all the players, all the players on the other team beat you in FIFA and start roasting you on how bad you are. All right? They just walk all over you. What are you going to do? I want to bash him, sir. Mm, not quite. Just, I like, the, I like the attitude. I like the thought. But just, just bring it down a notch. Um, what do you say? Oh, I'm going to bulldoze them. I'm going to bulldoze them, sir. That's it, mate. And I'm going to tackle them hard. There it is. That's my boy. I'm going to make a star out of you, mate. I'm going to make a star out of you. And they're going to call me the one, the coach. The coach that went through all the adversity to bring a championship to this school. Because enough is enough. I'm sick and tired of losing. Yeah. I love it, mate. Keep that energy going. Oh, what's the, um, what's the team name, sir? The, the team name? Yeah, um, the Greenfield Grasshoppers. Oh. Yeah, it's... Not a good name, I know. I've been telling them for years to change it, but they don't listen to me. So, um, yeah. You look good in green, mate. You look good in green. Don't worry about it, mate. <laughs> don't worry. Anyway, chapter one. Let's go. Physical education. If you're not doing 300 push-ups a day, you're weak.